that's pretty much the video. Pretty sure the thumbnail, I'm gonna look a lot more put together because this video is gonna be pre-recorded. Probably gonna take some pictures, dress up a little bit. But girl, it's been a long two days. I'm really, really happy with it. I think I am going to like cut this side a little bit shorter eventually. But for right now, I'm gonna leave it alone. In the past, I haven't been able to achieve this style because my hair was so long and I didn't wanna burn it off, of course. So now that my hair is short, I want to take advantage of finally getting a very short, well, a uh, semi-short, well, shoulder length, above the shoulder neck length, a box braid bob. And just a few tips. If you're going for the more stiff, bob kind of like this one where you can kind of like curl it under i would say make sure that you get a uh, braiding hair that isn't necessarily soft because the softer the hair the less likely it is to stay in place and to kind of stiffen up this hair is kind of soft so i would recommend maybe getting expression hair and also if you have shorter hair i would definitely recommend doing the smaller braids because you're going to be able to make these last a whole lot longer and they're going to be a whole lot fuller especially if you're trying to achieve that really true 90 style of box braids they have a lot of small box braids in their hair i'm very very happy i can't wait to dress this up right now i'm still bumming it in my flannel but the flannel is kind of 90s so it's working out but i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you think down below i hope i was able to get some decent angles this time and y'all it's just been a long two days but thankfully with patience and with a goal in mind i achieved it so let me know what you guys think down below and if you want to try this style thank you guys so much and i will see you guys in my next video Mwah.